What's happening, everybody? I'm Grimaster. Welcome back to more Breathage, and we are in the cooling station place that we found. Uh, all right, can we go inside of these? Is this gonna be like the molasses stuff? Nothing of interest. Okay, well that helps me. Just pop in, and it tells me that. Untreated waste solids detected. Solids detected. All right, that's a person. That's a person whose suit has been broken. Alright, well, I mean, I, I have oxygen in here, so I have all the time in the world to look. What's all this? Another person. Uh, electronic pass a certain Victor... His face is that way. That's Victor Gr Grenadash for sure. Now I understand why his face seems so familiar to me. Often visited Grandpa. Some business port. All right. The deceased is on the ship's crew list. I've checked. I don't know why though. All right. Well, I got his. I got the pass. Does that mean I can actually? Is, is it going to actually be used somewhere? So far, they haven't been. Oh God. How big is this bubble? Okay. Like I figured I'd be out of it by now. There wasn't anything else in there. I think there's alkali, apparently. Alright. Oh, there's more right here. Over there's where I'm supposed to go, but I want to see about it finding other things. So this mosaic. So that's why your relative's face seems so familiar to me. A brilliant engineer, one of the creators of the core, and the father of artificial intelligence. It's him. Amazing. Are you sure you're not adopted? <laughs> this robot dude, so kind. All right, can I go inside these? No, those are hard ones. The crew was killed shortly before the crash. They didn't even have anything to defend themselves with. Okay. There's stuff in here. Ooh, yes, I'll take that for sure. Gravity module. I don't even know what those are for, but I've gotten several of them. Equipment. I noticed that it's enough for a human to get one hit in any part of the body to die, whereas coffins only die when certain points on the head and stomach are damaged. Okay, head or stomach. Is that going to be for future knowledge? Yeah, it's like right in the side. Dude is gone and the trash dude is just... Wait, this is an energy core? I thought that was a little robot dude. That thing was much larger than I was expecting. Okay. I, I just never grabbed any of those because I never made the EMPs. That's cool. We can go back and make a whole bunch of stuff. Eventually. Uh, It's all hard. Yep. Alright, I guess I'll go to the actual point I'm supposed to go now. <laughs> Gotta check out all these other side things. Uh, one more last stop. You all hard? Oh, yep. According to some sketchy fragments of data, I assume that it might be the office of your grandpa and his team. Did you know that he was supposed to be on board the liner? No. Use. It's a good thing you only need to pass from a corpse, but not the corpse itself. Alright, well, let me grab these. I'm gonna grab these little small bits. Who knows if I'm gonna need them. So far, a lot of the stuff I've grabbed has been necessary. Uh, you and you. Use one. Apparently, your grandpa was supposed to fly as a crew member and monitor the corps' activities. I wish I'd had a chance to talk to him. Alright. A bunch of dead people all over the place. <laughs> Makes me a little concerned. Ooh, didn't even see this area. Someone's been looking for something here. I wonder what it was. Why would you say that? Stuff is just thrown everywhere. Lay chicken. Loved to sculpt when I was a kid. I was really good at it, but I remember this chicken turned out amazing. I ran to show it to Grandpa, but I tripped and got squished on the floor. I started crying, and my Grandpa tried to calm me down, saying this was... This way, it looked even better, and this made me cry even more. I can't believe Grandpa kept it. A masterpiece, or rather, it used to be a masterpiece. All right, like his station. That was basically happening here. <laughs> An old photo of my grandpa with his friend Ricky, and the grown-ups were drinking like fish. We seemed to get along pretty well with Ricky's grandson. Too bad they both disappeared somewhere. <laughs> That's awesome. That's awesome. 
Isn't this the brilliant scientist who disappeared with his grandson after claiming to have invented the portal gun? All right. Ah, <laughs> oh, Rick and Morty night. Most likely, the liner's core was remotely controlled from here, but someone broke everything. Right? This place is huge. I'm gonna get lost. Okay. Start with this door. Uh, York and Astra Physical Laboratory Observatory. I can't read. I don't know where my glasses are. The information about the spacesuit. I wouldn't have remembered its name, although Grandpa told me a lot about it and even took me there once. I remember, I looked through one of the most powerful telescopes on Earth and saw nothing. The Grandpa looked through it for hours and kept admiring some. Right. An old photograph. Little Grandpa sitting on his father's shoulders, and my Grandpa, good friend Uncle. Beijing is sitting at the table. He's an astronaut. I can't remember his name. It's either James or Philip. My great grandpa had already died before my birth. But Uncle Bugain, I'm probably slaughtering these names, visited grandpa often. He was a cool guy. He always smiled, talked about medicine, and helped grandpa fix his Erez van. Okay. Nope, you don't open. It's a <laughs> full on beard. Got a good spanking, then it hurts. Just remembering it's a shame the camera takes only one picture. So it would have been an interesting series of photos. By the way, later the chicken gave me a harder time than my poked him in the eye. What a great relationship. It's amazing that the chicken obeys you at all now. <laughs> a photo from the Energon Con where they present the improved engines of modern shuttles developed by my grandpa. Just a schoolboy at the time, but I actively helped grandpa to make a model of the engine that presentation and it was fun. I remember that event. I was at the dry cleaners after an unpleasant incident at the time, and while they were cleaning my circuit boards, I was taking a peek at the TV with literally just one of my sensors. What? Need a repair tool. What am I extracting? Filtration? I had another filter. Alright, I don't know if the, I assume these things are going to be used for something. Well, it wasn't apricot until I ate it. Really tasty. However, Grandpa gave me a good spanking for that and covered it with... Foxy resin, so I wouldn't spoil. I think someone gave him this apricot after the mass extinction of the plants on Earth. He dreamed of growing a real apricot tree on Kepler 438 one day. Okay. Mass extinction of plants on Earth? That seems bad. Your ticket's the largest planetarium in the galaxy. Very young then. But I remember how cool it was like it was yesterday. There were some doodles on the ticket before we got in, and the ticket collector refused to let us pass. I remember how it all worked out, but I remember my grandpa walking around the planetarium looking very happy and with the slip, slit lip. Okay. Uh. According to my data, this planetarium has the most detailed map of the galaxy. We could really use it right now. Yeah. I don't think we're gonna, we're gonna see that. Uh, alright, well he died on the toilet. Magnet. Fabric. Okay, there was another way. There was right here. Titanium, right? Any any story bits in here? Whole lot of nada. All right, let's go back in this room then. Gravity much? Why, why am I grabbing all these? I have to go drop stuff off, or just drop stuff in general if I have to. All the equipment was destroyed, and someone took all the data blocks. Okay, I got it. I got to fix this thing up. Uh, I got so many things. Drop these. Take that. Just take one space. It does. All right, I got two. Sweet. All right. This. Okay, that was the right direction, I guess. This felt like we were going in a circle. Nope, that's definitely not the right direction. Here we go. I mean, I guess we're going the right way. Just... The controller must be here somewhere. All right, maybe not. Yeah, I thought this was literally just going around in a circle. The cooling system controller. I told you it looked like uh, this. Yeah, sure. Vice. Vice. Okay, there's gonna be something I'm gonna have to do. Either the controller is broken, or we don't have access. In any case, I only need to examine its internals, so I suggest using a handy scrapper. Okay. They're breaking all this stuff. Yeah, that's what I figured. 
Oh no. Wait, I think I have a second one. I hope I have a second one. Please tell me I have a second one. Dude. That's not gonna do that's not gonna cut it. I'll break one. Okay, I see. Uh I'm gonna have to go back to the ship to make another thing. Dude, I mean I I have my inventory's full pretty much anyways, but still that sucks. Okay, so that run, that run basically just put uh All right. Here we go. Enough damage. I've made a blueprint of the cooling unit. You can feel how hot my logic board is. No less than 85 degrees. All right, so now I do the blueprint. Touch the circuit board. Touch the circuit board. Touch the circuit. I knew you wouldn't say no. It's hot, isn't it? Just like Normandy's core, which we need to cool down already. However, I have some unpleasant news for you. I found out where to find the working fluid for the cooling unit, but you are unlikely to like it. In any case, we will need a drill and moral depravity. Okay. 220 meters away. Uh, drill and moral What? What are we going to have to do? Oh... Uh, yeah, that 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 run right there just for the last station. It's a shame. <laughs> I didn't realize how far away we were. Uh, I guess we're just going to run back there. 200 meters. Is this going to be all the way like out in the beginning? I can't stop thinking about your brilliant relative. He clearly worked here and designed many of the liner systems. Could the accident have been caused by someone who needed his body or the data from his office? Uh, interesting. Like how we're like getting the story bits that I was not foreseeing. Yes, that's right. The working fluid is inside of them in the area of the bladder. We really need it, but they don't. Another elderly person with cardiac failure. I don't envy their funerary spacesuits. It must be so stressful for them. It's the working fluid, no doubt about it. Okay. So you, so you want me to get this out of multiple? It's hard to tell anything from these remains. All right, Bruce. Can't get it out of you. I don't know how many I'm gonna need, but what strange remains? If I make the assumption that coffins can replace the corpses inside them with fresh bodies like batteries, would you think I'm crazy? All right. Here we go. Kind of gross. I don't know how many of these things I need. So basically, I need to go make up all the stuff. I don't, I don't know how much. Who? Maybe notice we're actually like drilling into. There's like a drill mark left in the stomach. <laughs> All right. Uh, I really don't want to run all the way back here again because even this is a good distance away. Can we go in here? Oh, that took me up there. That's right. That was just another way to go. I don't need to go. cardiac there. arrest. A common reaction of an elderly body to G-force. All right, items. That should work. When installing it, don't touch the core's shell. What's this, navigator? Filtration system? When did I get those? Filter times four, titanium times two, light of, okay. Filter times four. I know I've gotten some filters. But what do they look like? To grab, oh, two. I only have two. Okay. So where do I install this? Oh, it's got to be outside. Wait, how can I can't get outside? It's got to be inside. There's no way it's outside. Great, it works. At least now you won't get fried inside of me and smear my lining with your combustion residue. Okay. Yeah, that's that's a positive. Okay, I don't have the filtration and the navigation. All right, well, what did the navigator take? I'm pretty sure we still don't have the items, but... Navigation chip times four. I don't know what to do with all these. I'm just gonna go drop them in a corner. So why not? I decided to loot remains mixed with the shavings of some poor frozen guy. Uh, they filled the dead people with the stuff for deep cooling, but I still, I still don't get why the liquid can only be obtained from the bladder. Right. Gross. Wait. 
Oh, that they're pulsating, it's just little circles that are. Well, oh. <laughs> Alright, let's put all this stuff away. Here we go. Yep, I don't have any of the other stuff, so we must have to go to other places. No, there is definitely something wrong here. I tried to track the flight path of your relative's body using the information of the coffins we opened earlier. He disappeared right after you lost him. Moreover, the other coffins didn't receive either any signal about the destruction of the coffin or its coordinates. All right. Oh, I mean to click. All right. So, I'm assuming the next place we need to go is going to be over there. It doesn't really seem to be any. I mean, we can't pick up any items, as far as I can tell. We have one of six Normandy ship things on the line. And the unknown module. Great. Let's go. I also notice that you visit all the places that I ask and not you not to visit. Am I mistaken? Don't you take a risk for yourself because of your stubbornness? Now we definitely need to fly there. Yeah, I, I feel like somebody pointed out in the comments that with the way this game's humor is, Babe is actually going to be a Babe. And it's just going to be like I can't a translation. It. It's a teleporter. If we fly through it at a certain speed, we can get to our station that we left behind. Oh, is that this thing? So basically, we can go back now. The automatic maintenance team compartments were located on the outer plating of the liner. No wonder they survived. Can I dock? Oh my god. Okay. How do I just get out of this thing? Can I, is, it, is it possible? It does not appear to be. I assume I can't fly in here now. It's like there's a place here. Oh. Did this again. This is the This is the healing place, isn't it? Yeah, I don't even need this place. It's exactly what I did before. I wish I could boost. There's no boost. Coffee bot, coffee bot, coffee bot. Oh, it's a station? Alright, let's destroy this. I don't think that's the state. Is that the station? I'm confused. Station's hidden, isn't it? Or we got enemies? Level two calibrated. Any target right. defense more effective. Drop it. Take you out. I'm gonna do the spinning circle thing again. Woo! Ah oh, man, I almost take several. Oh, there we go. Gotcha. Where was the station? Yeah, the station's in there. Alright, you guys just... Sir, no sir? What? I don't know what that means. Maybe because I've shot enough of them down? Oh my god. Here we go. Ooh. I got hit. There's no on the passengers who live inside the box. But ordinary people can definitely not afford it. I'm sure there's something interesting that we know. There might even be a whole space. Alright. Uh, I feel like I should probably take out the stage. Alright, there you are. There you are. I can see you now. Gonna go crazy on this first. I don't know if he's pooping out bots or what. Okay, now they're shooting at me. They're 100% shooting at me. See where there was a repair station. Oh my god. Right on the target. There we go. I actually, kind of, kind of see the coffin bot for a second, the first time. Uh, did I get both? No way. Nope. The other one's right there. All right. Line up the shots. What? You go too far away? I don't understand. There we go. Alright, so there's a bunch of different places that popped up. You want me to go here? The place right here, this is the closest one. I think there is like, yeah, there's one there, there's one right there. Alright, lots of places to go now. So many places to go now. 
Okay, probably. We need to go a little slower. The wormhole didn't have enough time to form. What? Something's wrong. Try flying backwards. Perhaps the teleporter doesn't have enough time to collect enough ionic mass. It didn't work. There's a possibility that the teleporter is damaged and it doesn't have enough power. Perhaps if you fly and shoot at the same time, the plasma charges will collide with the positron grid of the portal, disperse it, and open the gateway. And no. You know, theoretically, the portal might not work because portals don't exist at all. Do you believe in any pseudoscientific nonsense? How on earth would there be a portal here? It's just some part of an engine. And our station has probably been destroyed by drifting debris long ago. <laughs> what the hell? Okay. Uh, does that mean we aren't going back? I'm confused by this. That was evil. I was, I, <laughs> that was evil. Alright, anyways. Anyways. This is the repair station. There's 3,000 meters that way. 2,800 this way. We're gonna go this way. If anything else pops up, cool. I'll, I'll deal with it then, but... I'm gonna keep heading this way for now. And now there's a question mark over here, too. 4,000. Oh my god, and then there's a, there's a hand thing right there that's 1,900. I'm already going here. Going here. It looks like some pastures for synthetic cows. Someone surely didn't know a better way to invest their money. So wait, are we going to actually find living cows in here? Interesting. Oh. Maybe not. Boss is broken grip. Well, I mean, we haven't found anything living now that I think about it. We're literally the only thing alive other than Babe, if Babe's real. That is up. Alright. I made the... One of these things, it's like invincible, so. I think we're good. I never have to make another one again. Whoa. Oh, it's gotta load the module. <laughs> yeah, I used all my titanium, so I need Without more. Without a doubt, it's a luxury habitation module. Alright. Cool. Uh. Artemy. What do I not have? I have everything. I have a grabber. I don't have a drill. I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna make a drill before I leave. I'm not freaking having to run all the way back because I forgot about the need to have a drill. So I guess it's just we'll find out as we go. Yep, I have a drill at least. And I have a gun. Boodoop, which I realized later that I probably could have shot those things and they would have broke. But they're whatever. This wire. Hey, robot dude. I've no desire to open the coffins, but now I'm sure they work on the energy produced by the decomposing bodies in them. It's disgusting and brilliant at the same time. Alright. Um... That's three? We only need one more? What a big corpse. I won't be able to scan his face since it's no longer there, but I can assume from his shape that it's the head of the Green Universe Department on Kepler-62, Fat Jim. Okay. Wait. Something else popped up, maybe. No? no it's, just, it's just showing me this through this thing. Quite a strange trophy for a nature lover. In addition to the incredible peacefulness, these synthetic creatures generally barely move their legs from laziness. Hunting them is like hunting a stone. Alright, I don't want... I mean... Oh, it only takes one space. Why not just take random junk with me? Oh, a generator! Condensed milk? A can of condensed milk be exact synthetic condensed milk. That's why I don't eat it. Somebody once bought me at my grandpa a can of real condensed milk, which they bought on the black market in a remote sector of the galaxy. So delicious that I even started crying. Maybe I started crying after a good spanking from taking the condensed milk without permission. I don't remember. Eating condensed milk is not a bad way to get fat, but a bad way to die after that. The ingredients of this product have long raised questions among doctors. Okay. Package of nutritious and tasty grass, according to the manufacturer, despite the active promotion of the product as the best food in space. Everyone still continues to choke on various types of goo. As for the grass itself, they roll up cigarettes from it. I'm sure Jim got fat on grass in humility, because that is what he promoted, as far as I know. Alright. Oh, dear God. What? Milko? Sure. I wonder why it doesn't get banned. 
It's probably not because Milko's owner is the party leader's relative. Sure, yeah, that's probably not. Why? Got fabric. Is there anything I can do with you? No? Alright, I guess I'm just out. Yep, I'm out. Oh, go to the other side. He was shot everywhere. By the way, that's Banana Frank. He's presumably one of the leaders of the Green Universe. Okay, so this is clearly Green Universe is doing. Is it though? I mean, the robot things. I don't know anymore. I think the robots are clearly the, you know, evil here. Nothing in your toilet? Alright, well, you got a really big place. The benefits of vegetarianism for rabbits. The book is trash for sure, but I must say that I've been encouraging people to be vegetarians through a deep study of food supply for rabbits. The authors inadvertently created a guide to the proper fattening of those cute animals. Breeders were very grateful for such detailed science work and brought it up all over books for a no, week. What? Okay. I've no doubt about the benefits of vegetarianism, especially for herbivores. If only it could help against blasters. <laughs> okay. Alright. Well, where was I supposed to go? I guess we keep going this way. Inventory space is still fine. I feel like at some point we're going to be fighting robots, right? Someone was dragged out into the corridor. Okay. I doubt anyone survived here. I, I he was do. dragged out of the cabin to unlock the door. A retinal scan is an extremely unpleasant method of data protection, especially for the owner of the retina. Sam and Baklava? Why? A Baklava of a Green Universe activist. No. There's a Green Universe. Knitted these masks themselves, which made the elderly population of the galaxy overwhelmed with tender emotion. Despite the seemingly good protection for facial identification, the activist could be still be, could be identified in the crowd. And caught. I wonder why. I don't know why they took off his mask. It obviously didn't interfere with scanning his eye. Right. Uh, I mean, it doesn't look like he's a hit. What the heck? I didn't mean to take that. Ah, uh, whatever. Whatever. Creation package? I don't see anything else here worth the value, but I want to check this out. I did. I saw the body, and it said, follow the body, so I followed the body. Dude, why'd you gotta go break it? I would have played. Let's well, not. Both corpses belong to the leaders of the green universe. I have the impression that all the important people of this organization were flying in this module. Yeah, that's what it's kind of seeming like right now. Can of beef. Christian package. Broccoli as the main symbol of green universe is frequently used not only in cheesy slogans on fences, but also in commercial activities. Can imagine who actually buys these symbols for of a terrorist organization. The store shelves are chock full of these. A very useful thing in space. Okay. Uh, electronics, electronics. Oh, we got another one. Here we go. Give me this. One more filter thing needed. All right. I I don't think I'm gonna get in here, am I? No. All right. Whatever. What? Is this thing golden? Is that just the lighting in here? Okay, no, it's white. Alright, it just has, a uh, Silver, anyways. Has the, like, dude A green universe thing on logo. It. It's rather peculiar, I must say. Wait, what? Oh. Uh... That cow's eating a human hand. It doesn't seem good. All right. It's locked from the inside and welded shut from the outside. This type of door is unfamiliar to me. It's probably some military project. Okay. That guy is squished. That's sealed. And that's sealed. Seems like this robot tried to make itself wired, but it only burned out. By the way, the coffins clearly don't have external charging ports. <laughs> well, I have all four of the navigation chips I need now, so we're good there at least. What is the big Fred's big secret? What did Fred M Momini, leader of the Green Universe, 
Organization to start a war on space funerals? Oh my god, there's a whole thing. I like kind of unique investigation that caused a lot of talk and damaged the reputation of Frederick Mon Money. However, considering that his reputation was already bad even with the investigation, Money didn't really worry too much about that. A yellow press article. Sometimes it has more information than an entire department of detectives, especially incompetent ones. It looks like all the doors are locked, and I don't know how to open them. Wait, wait. Can I smash them? I mean, we can still keep going. So this I'm door still is going. also unfamiliar to me, but it's clearly from a different series. Huh? What? All right. Uh, is every single door sealed? All right. I guess we're going through this one. Assuming I'm supposed to bust it down. A uh, great tool when you put it to good use. If you have extra limbs, you can fasten the saw to an, outer, an angle grinder. Try not try to use it not on wood, but on metal. The owner of the saw tried, and he died. It looks like he's from the green universe, and apparently oh. he hasn't heard about the dangers of a circular saw blade on an angle grinder. What? Casing? Despite his foolish death, this man clearly knew about the weak point in the door's design and tried to open it. I can modify the angle grinder's blueprint a little so that we could continue the dead man's work of destruction and get under the dome. Dude, you want me to go all the way back again? Why? That's so evil! Stop making me run all the way back to the beginning of these things! I'm back on the ship. So we're making a saw drill? And then I have enough navigational chips. Saw and drill at the same time. Probably if you really believe it can work. <laughs> There's a small chance it's not quite correct. I can make the navigator though. And now we'll have a second thing upgraded on the ship. Ba doop. All right, navigator installed. I want to take the steering wheel for a second. I'm gonna still go back in here. So yeah, it is like two of the things up there at the top left next to my health are are up now I docking it you've assembled a real what is that you read my instructions didn't you <laughs> all right well hey it works right the door is loose just kick it out all right what what I was expecting a slightly different result, but this will do as well. Okay. okay. Uh. Hello? The guy's shooting over here. Can I, can I jump over it? There we go. They tried to open the doors from the inside, but they got badly injured and lost too much blood. Okay. Yeah, there's like a a real forest in the middle of space. It's not very rational, but impressive. Ooh. Do I need to shoot you or what? You make it stop shooting? It doesn't really seem like it. Don't shoot me, don't shoot me, don't shoot me. Judging by the signals, the robot has been damaged. Only this little part of the program remains. Exodus. Exodus. After stopping the liner, all those who were involved are subject to disposal. Execution of the Exodus plan is activated. All group leaders must be prepared. No more of you. Wow, I couldn't even hear anything. It's so flipping loud. Alright. Got trees in space, that's cool. I assume it's all good. I wanna go make sure that I grab everything. There's a generator link here, like that's that's exactly what I'm talking about. That's just something that's a freaking big thing that I don't have to create later on. Don't I have a light? I don't remember how to turn it on. Yeah, I totally have a light. There we go. It's all dark over here. All right, laser beam freaking robot gone now. Can I check everything else? Uh, more metal. I'm basically out of that again. Bunch of dead people. The deceased were members of the green universe. They were all shot before the crash. 
They're all shot before the crash? Wonder how they picked him out. <laughs> they're like wearing green suits and they're having to have those things on. I don't see anything out there. I'm trying to see like any of the little story bits, because I always like the story bits. Careful. Active anti-asteroid protection. We could use it, by the way. What? What? We need to somehow bypass the protection without breaking it. Ooh. Uh, compensator? Alright, go, 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 go. The shuttle's registration number is hidden. Given that the leaders of the green universe were in the habitation modules, there was someone even worse here. Alright. These wires lead to the Ow. shuttle, and judging by the markings, they are designed to power light weapons. Okay, good. Got shot. And just break this? Oh, nope, chicken I time. I wanted to ask you for a long time about your warm relationship with the chicken, but I won't say anything. By the way, the anti-asteroid protection is deactivated. Alright. Yeah, I mean, like, why do we have the chicken on a stick? Oh, I mean, I, no, I guess it isn't always. Chicken was in a, uh, a military outfit at one point. Alright, anything else out here? I don't see anything. I think that was basically all I needed to do. Inventory's full? Oh, because those things are big. Alright, whatever. Probably gonna have to drop some stuff, but that's fine. Alright, let me in. It can't be. This is the personal shuttle of Frederick Momoni, leader of the Green Universe. And it looks like these are his personal body parts. The communications node was hacked, if I may say so. It could be that Frederick is ill, but it's more likely that someone had killed him long before the liner took off. Really? A uh, microphone, a simple oscillator, electrical tape, and a piece of meat. Study of anatomy ended up at age 15 when I got to, uh, never mind. But this looks like a windpipe, and I'm not sure how this thing worked, but it must have worked successfully as Green Universe members followed their dead leader's orders. Gross. I My inventory is full. I can't take that even if I wanted to. Uh, drop you. I didn't realize I still had that with me. I mean, I got a lot of metal. I could drop some of this. Still have a bunch on the ship, too. I just want to take it. It looks case. like someone was simply using the Green Universe activists, and none of the orders came from Mr. Momoni at all. Alright, see, and that's what I mean. Like, it doesn't always say something. Pick it up. Apparently being shocked an artificial intelligence of the spacesuit went into forced update mode. Never returned. Perhaps some specialties will be able to extract the details of Frederick's death from it. Maybe not. All right, or maybe not. Some of those real quick. Go, electronics. Ooh, definitely. That'll take, 100%. 100%. And here is the anti-asteroid protection system. We don't even need to hack it, as it has already been done for us. I got all the filters I need. What, where, what? This? Splendid. Now we only need to find a few rare parts. Uh, grab her. There we go. Give me you. Microplasm. Alright, well, I, I guess we're good then, right? I just need to go back to my ship. I think. I mean, I need to make it, but... I may not have everything right now. Whee. So, the main leader of the green universe is long dead, the other leaders are killed, and the crash was initiated by some unknown people who control the coffins. Sounds like a B action movie script. <laughs> Alright. Inventory's full. Inventory's full of junk! I do have a lot of junk in my inventory, but I don't want to leave it behind. I want to throw it in my ship and take it with me. But I think that's awesome. All right. Oh, I didn't realize both sides. I want to believe that Breathage is not involved in all this, but I must inform you that when you signed the contract for the funeral, you agreed to everything in the terms of service. To absolutely everything. All right. What that entail? I don't say anything about it, or You're talking about just like when you sign a coffin that like when despite the obvious signs of some large-scale conspiracy i still have the feeling that the catastrophe was accidental i can't figure out what the hypothetical terrorists might have gained from the complete destruction of the liner most likely the activists of the green universe were following orders to capture the liner and then simply screwed up which is confirmed by some of our findings 
<laughs> I mean, it's... Yeah? Okay. It just keeps telling me the story as I'm going back out here. Alright, so we can at least make... The filtration thing. I may be able to make whatever this new bit is that we just unlocked. But I don't know. The equipment, items... What's the new part right here? anti astro projection. Microplasm times two. What? Is there gonna... My, uh... Do I need to find another ship? Like this one? A magnet and an inductor. Alright, well... I can do this one now. Give me four filters and two alkali. And I did. And that sucked. Throw this on the ground. I have a few things to throw on the ground. Over here. This is my pile. I need to move because my pile is getting... Uh, you and all of this stuff. As far as these, I'm just gonna throw over here with this. Put that on the ground. Throw the generators on the ground. Saves me a whole lot of space. And there we go. Filtration system installed. So am I done here? Yeah, you're telling me to make the thing, but I can't. Uh, I'm assuming that I'm gonna have to find this out of another ship. I mean, there's still at least two more places to go. Take the wheel. If I have to come back, I have to come back. It is what it is, and I'll do it later. For now, I want to go at least to one more place. But yeah, we have three things active now. 1,500 meters over here, there's a dead cow thing? I'm confused. Wait. Wasn't this the cow place? No, this was an entirely different place. This is the cow place. Yeah, I don't I don't know what it's trying to tell me to come over here. I don't see anything. Alright, whatever. Let's go down here. 2,000 over 1,000 right there. That's a repair station, though. 4,000 of that question mark. Are you? 3,000 to that. I'm going. I'm not going down there. <laughs> there's, there's still so many places left. Alright, whatever. I'm going over here, I guess. 2,000 there, and then I'll go to that one afterwards, but... I don't know if I'll have time. I'm not going to have time to get to both of them. I'm at an hour recording right now, but there's been so much time of me running back and forth inside these giant light, huge space stations. I can't leave yet. Where? Watch the turrets. Oh. It looks like it's one of the space military police models. They're the best defense systems. If we can't find a working one, we could at least try to remove some of their armor bay and have the holes on home. I can't shoot it? Oh, I can. Okay. I was thinking, like, I should be able to shoot these, right? And I have turrets. <clears throat> yeah, I'm just gonna blow you up. What, what? Where, what? Oh. I take you out? Or you take me out? Oh my god, I can't aim them. Alright. Talking! Oh, I got I freaking... I held the button, and then I didn't. I did not like that. Okay. And we're off? It's got to load up the next place. All right. Whoa. Apparently, I'm... we won't find any survivors here either. Yeah, I don't I don't expect to ever find any survivors anywhere. So Yeah, there's that. Pretty much everybody's always dead. Hey, a door. How unexpected. Come on. Really? Wait, okay, I want to test the theory. Yep, that works. Simply shoot it, and it'll break super fast. There's gonna be something that's gonna require the gravity modules, I am sure. This container seems familiar. Isn't it the capsule containing one of those ugly cow chicken hybrids that you irresponsibly launched to the surface of the planet? I hope it was empty already, because there's no sign of the mutant itself. Oh, this is gonna be cool. Am I gonna fight an alien cow? 
Oh, this is amazing. Door is locked. Alright, so that's good. Door is gonna open up at some point. Follow the green goo. Follow the green goo. These tracks don't bode well. Oh, I think they bode awesomely well. I'm excited for what they bode for. I can't imagine how hard the blow was. Uh... It Wait. seems to be the only way to get to the military shuttles. I suggest we turn back and try to find a safer place to loot. Alright, it's still anti-grav. Oh, now I'm actually near the gravity thing. I see what you're talking about. Alright. Oh, so we gotta go back and we gotta go build that. That's why I've been getting all these gravi gravity modules. And... Anti-grav. Gravity module times four, inductor, compensator, and battery. This isn't something I need in my ship, though, is it? I don't know. I'm gonna find out, I guess. Read you right now. Let's go see if I can stick it in my ship first. Uh, it's kind of a battery. I wonder why. Navigator. Creation. Well, where do you even upgrade? Because I'm missing parts to this thing still. I don't know. I think we're good. I don't see anything popping up on the ship to put it in. Dull anti-gravity. Use. Now you face a fine under Clause 867A of the agreement for damaging the spacesuit with slime of an unknown origin. Alright, I'm in no control right now. These are the tracks of the survivors. It's a shame they are bloody. Alright, food, food, food. Can't I, like, just save my game naturally? I want I don't know the last time I saved. I assume is when I entered the ship last. But just to be on the safe side, let's save our game right now. There's lots of, uh, like he said, bloody footprints. Alkali, because I'm going to probably need to make more batteries. Right. That. I've detected some signs of an unknown infection on this body. According to intergalactic regulation number six, you must take some samples. Nasal swab sample. What was it in your it's nasal sample of the victim's navel secretions in the absence of medical equipment is taken from rusty nail lying nearby. Who who cares? Although I don't think the sample will help anyone, it never hurt to be too cautious. There is a chance that the death was due to a huge hole in his stomach, and there are no traces of infection besides common acne on his face. Still, it's better to be safe and send the sample to Earth. Otherwise it might turn out like in twenty twenty with COVID nineteen, but only we will be the ones to blame. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's right, because it's like this game was supposed to be released sooner, but because of everything that happened, it got pushed back. Like, I think it was supposed to be September last year, but then, yeah, everything that happened, it got pushed back to this year. And, I mean, this is this is amazing. So, I, I didn't have a problem waiting. I absolutely love this game. This is where it came from. I went that way first. I wanted to see if there's any of these doors open. Nope. All right, so this is a dead end. All right, let's go. Charge into the next room. There was a real massacre here not so long ago. Okay. Strange egg. Looks like some strange egg. Maybe something could hatch out of it. For some reason the chicken doesn't want to sit on it. What is this thing? Throw it away. Yeah, I don't know what's up with your face, but that's gross. What's wrong? What's wrong? Throw it away. I don't want to throw it away. The tangled footprints leading from the cabin, the mutant attacked these unfortunate fellows and got drunk on their blood, which had a lot of something alcohol containing in it. Okay. Uh, can of beef. Dude is inside of a window. Alright, things went well here. Jar opener? Against the backdrop of global emancipation of women and the inability to open a simple glass jar due to the difference in physical abilities between men and women, worried the most proactive feminist, Professor Shara volunteered to solve the problem and created this miracle of engineering for which he was labeled as a dirty misogynist for life. See, I want to take it and see the thing. I wonder if the inventor would have evaded criticism if he had made it in the shape of a female hand. I always like hearing what the, the, the AI has to say. After the invention of artificial intelligence, there was no sense in having mathematical competitions anymore. I would beat any champion, even if I just had one CPU core. Alright. Didn't, uh... Need to immediately pick that thing up. What was it even? 
Tavern's per poster non alcoholic beer was just drunk at the famous Hill Tall's Mathematical Olympiad. Don't know if it was really popular among the participants of the Olympiad, but there were definitely no sober people among the audience. Alright. Onward. By the way, there's a chance that these are the only survivors besides us and your interlocutor with a strange accent. To be more precise, they were the only survivors until you launched a capsule with a mutant at them. Oh god. I didn't even think about that. Oh, is this is this from what we launched at them and not something that just broke out? I feel a little bit bad now. Only a little bit. Oh god. Arms are gone. Seek help on that one. What is this? I, I was gonna say, you better not make me freaking go back and make another one. I will be pissed. <laughs> Alright, let's go. What the? Hey, Run! Hey. No, I wanna shoot it. It's definitely the mutant from the capsule. I hope it won't be able to get in there and come after us, but we'd better get out of here. By the way, we found the shuttles. Oh, hey, that's actually what I was looking for. All the shuttles are damaged. However, we only needed their armor plates in the first place. Well, I don't understand mutant language, but it definitely wants to kill us. Where is it? Where is it? I don't like that. Hey, I can't do anything here. All the shuttles are damaged. Well, I was thinking, huh. Maybe this is where I'll get that other piece I need. Um, yeah, that's the filter. I'm so on my toes. I, I feel like something bad's about to happen. We can't get them from the outside. Maybe we can pick them off from the inside. Whoa. And no, we won't be able to pick anything off from here. What? What do you want about? Navigation chip. Subnautica. A journey through the primordial soup. <laughs> Alright. A journey of brave explorer through the primordial soup of the planet. When I played this game, I honestly didn't understand how the main character managed to carry tons of stuff in his pockets. Unrealistic. Now I understand. He would do anything to survive. I bet you've learned most of your survival skills from such games, haven't you? <laughs> and uh, here's the owner of the shuttle. Examine toy steering wheel? The steering wheel you can learn to control a real ship. Dendo created it with great love to detail. Even has an airbag that shoots out of the face of the most difficult modes in the simulator. Looks like this guy confused the toy wheel with the real one and tried to get away during the battle. Well, games don't get you anywhere, that's for sure. Especially if you're an idiot. <laughs> Alright, well we got we got what we needed. Um I love I love when a game is just so like, you know, observant of itself of being a game. Alright, I want to go down here and check this out. What is it? Anything to say? What? Famous philosopher in Japanese roots, he's considered genius. Maybe he is. I don't know. Although his wobbly toy is in a jar, which means turns it into a non-wobbly toy, and this is unique, unusual. For such a toy. I don't know anything about this person, but I can feel something genius about this toy. Yeah, she caught you? What? Okay, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just gonna drop you. Alright. Now it's time to actually go in here and get what we need, but that was the other piece of what I needed to make the other thing that we learned. So, I mean... <laughs> yay! <laughs> it's what I needed. I just now need to find whatever this is. What did you want me to do here? Here it is, an armor plate that we can use to close the hole in the core. They haven't fully welded it. You need to tear off the brackets and lower the jack. Shoot them off? Oh, that just broke. Uh, there we go. Me. Oh, okay, I'm like, dude, how much health do you have? I honestly can't tell. Wait. Okay, two of four. Like, I don't want this thing to fall on my head. Great, it remains only to lower the jack. 
Right, lower deck. I didn't think that the weight of the plate was more than 900 kilos. Maybe we should take a closer look at it. Oh my god. All right. That was great. Judging by the remains of the mutant, the it doesn't look like we can carry it. This is a mechanic from some other game. You don't have any strength at all. It's time to go back. All right. Um, I'll go I smoosh. hope it was the only one here. I'll go smoosh. Okay, well, I, I guess we're good. We can make this uh, zoom when we go back the other way. There's no other reason for me to be here. I mean, this takes me all the way out, right? Is that what this is? Uh, I think? I don't know what this monster would have done to us if it had caught up with us, but did you see its terrible animations? I've never seen anything like it. It's definitely the most creepy creature in the universe. <laughs> Okay, that's what I mean by being self-aware. It's just, it's awesome. I don't it know, it entertains like me a corridor. lot. We can use it to go back so we won't have to crawl through the ventilation system. Some more traces of slime. The mutant clearly used the technical corridors. By the way, I wonder how many mutants survived the flight to the planet. Is there going to be another one? I kind of feel like there's going to be another uh, one. Here's the way out, probably. And yes, I was right. We got back to Normandy. Great. I recommend that we get out of here as soon as possible. We can't install any armor plates. We can't steal any shuttles. So we have nothing else to do here. All right. Hmm, by the way, while we were running from the monster, someone patched up our holes and put armor plates on the hole. Probably it's the local repair team who worked on it when they noticed the identification marks on Captain Shepard's ship. So it turns out that we could have stayed in the shuttle all this time. <laughs> all right. Oh, that's, that's okay. Uh, let me just toss this on the ground real quick. So we don't even have to make anything for that one. That's awesome. Okay, equipment items. Uh, it was this one. Need a magnet and an inductor. All right, equipment items and anti-asteroid protection. Protection. That's right. Protection. Protection. All right. I'm assuming in here. Yeah, because it looks like it's not fully like finished. So we have one more thing to do. Get this away. All right. So yeah, there's literally only one other part we have left. I don't think we should ever visit this place again. Yeah, it's probably for the best. All right. Well, you know what? I am gonna leave it here right now. For now, though, it's been an hour, an hour and a half almost. So <laughs> I'm gonna leave it here. And next time we we only have like. One more part to do on our actual ship, and it's fully fixed. Do I have a sprint yet? No. But there's two places way over there. Those are both repair stations, though, right? Yeah, those are both repair stations. There's the cow thing there that I don't understand. Uh, um... I think all that's left otherwise is just that one over there, then? Yep, that's the last place we need to go to to get the last part of our ship. So I guess we'll finish that next time and we'll end up taking off somewhere else. I don't know if we go back, if we go forward, I don't, I don't know. We'll find out. But yep, thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye for now.